This is one that people ask me. I speak on stage a lot about social media marketing, Facebook ads, lead generation, product sales for e-commerce, and everybody's throwing around different terms. They hear 60 seconds, they hear 90 seconds. All of you are wrong. What is the best length for a Facebook video ad? Now, this is something that everybody is throwing around different terms, 60 seconds, 90 seconds. Everybody is getting it wrong. So in this video, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna break it down for you and show you exactly what the best optimal length Length is for a video ad for running on Facebook. Hey, so I push and I grind and I push and I grind because I know one day it's gonna pay y'all. What's up everyone, my name is Mike Sherrard. Thank you so much for tuning in. As always, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I drop multiple videos every single week helping you scale your business using creative and innovative content and marketing strategies. And all that I'm asking is a thumbs up, subscribe, and lightly tap that notification bell. So let's get straight into it. What is the best ideal optimal length for a Facebook video ad? This is one that people ask me. I speak on stage a lot about social media marketing, Facebook ads, lead generation, product sales for e-commerce, and everybody's throwing around different terms. They hear 60 seconds, they hear 90 seconds. All of you are wrong. Now, I'm gonna give you a very blunt answer, but then I'm gonna to explain to it and how it relates to different industries. So what is the answer? There is no optimal length. There's videos that convert extremely high that are 15 seconds. There's videos that convert extremely high that are nine minutes. So let me explain to you exactly how you need to find out how long your videos should be because there's no one right answer. There's different industries, there's different types of ads and different target demographics so you need to understand that in order to find the right length so that you can convert the highest rate possible so let me give you an example I know somebody that does coaching for helping people get out of the nine to five and get financial freedom okay ultimately this is a middle-aged man and he makes five hundred thousand dollars a month from Facebook ads what do his Facebook ads look like he takes his little device here his phone he's sitting in his SUV and he records videos very raw unedited for about seven and a half to nine minutes and it's just him talking providing value to his audience it's a seven and a half to nine minute video but that's what it takes in order for him to deliver the right amount of value to the right audience for his ads what you need to understand is you need to look at how are you providing value so that's one case where somebody needs to give context to what they're talking about because it's not a quick decision so with somebody like that a longer video is okay now let's look at all my friends that have e-commerce products 15 to 30 seconds max because attention spans short for those, you're looking for people to make a quick impulse decision and you want it to be very engaging, very high impact, and you want it to just grab attention, suck people in, send them to your funnel and convert them like that. E-commerce, you want your ads to be a lot shorter. You want them to be much higher impact. You want them to be very engaging, very high editing quality, very high video quality, lots of text overlays, lots of motion. Usually the clips should be no longer than three seconds each. And again, this is going to be much shorter, much more to the point, but ultimately that's because when you look at the people that you're trying to run ads to, it's usually a cold audience that you're, you're trying to get their attention amongst the clutter of everything else on Facebook. Now let's look at the final type of ads, which is the third type, which is going to be more along the lines of service-based industries, okay? Real estate agents, mortgage brokers, accountants, lawyers, any other service-based industry that's doing lawn care, things like that. Their ads are typically between 60 seconds and 90 seconds because again, you're not making making so much of an impulse decision. There's some sort of background educational level, but they don't need so much information that it's six to seven minutes long where you feel like, okay, you're drowning them out and you're just boring them to death. So I proved that in real estate. If you look at any of the property tour ads are usually around the 60 second mark to upwards of 90 seconds. And that's what's going to give enough information to the end user. So that's what I urge you to do. Whenever you're running Facebook ads and using video, which is the best way to do it, you want to make sure you're looking at a couple things. You're looking at one, what is the target demographic? Two, which part of the funnel is the audience in? Are they in top of funnel? Are they very cold? Is it the first time seeing you? Are they in the middle of the funnel, warmer audience? Or are they a hot lead in the bottom of the funnel ready to get converted? Also look at what you are trying to convey to them. If you're trying to get an impulse buy, of course you want a shorter, quicker to the point ad. Are you trying to give contextual relationship that preframes things, show them why they need you and show them all the details about what your product or service can do for them? Then yeah, have something long 
longer. If you're smack in the middle, you know the answer. So if you have any other questions about Facebook ads for e-commerce or products or services, whatever, drop a comment below. I'd love to answer you. I answer 100% of people that engage with my content. Otherwise, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe, tap that notification bell. Give this video a little watch because it's going to be of huge value to it. I guarantee it. And we will see you next time.